I check out my clock. I just got from Amazon. I think it's from Wallard. It's an alarm clock, but I have the alarm set off. I'm getting a little bit. There we go. I'm trying to get the, oh man, look at the clock, guys. Check it out. There's no word to describe how much I love this clock. This now is my favorite clock. People like to collect things. I love to collect shoes and boots. Uh, flashlights, knives, and clocks. Let me tell you how much I like this clock. This is my all-time favorite clock that I've ever had. It looks so tough in the room, it's not even funny. It has the date, it has the temperature, it has an alarm. I mean, honestly, and let me just back out a little. I mean, just it, it just screams out alpha male, cool. I love the construction of it. It's not cheaply made. There, it looks like it has substance to it. Um, it came very, very securely packaged. And right now I just have it on the stand right there. It has these two things that flick out. Let me see if I can get you a better picture of that, like that. Um, it took all of about two minutes to set up the clock, honestly, two minutes. It was just like really, really simple. I've had some clocks. It was like I had to go and get a, a master's degree to set the time on it, and it was just a nightmare. But this clock, I'm telling you, is probably less than a minute. It comes with the coveted wall mount, meaning this. It shows you exactly where the holes need to be. So if you put this on the wall where you want your clock, then you just put a nail here, a nail here, hammer them in, and your clock will fit perfectly on the wall. I do have a dilemma. I love this clock so much. I was going to put this in the bedroom, but now I really don't know where to put the clock because it looks so cool out here. I mean, I got the fireplace going. I got some candles going. I got my weights over there. I might have to order a couple more of these clocks, and I'm not kidding. That's how nice it is. It is big for a digital display clock. I've never seen anything bigger than this, and I know there's probably some company out there that makes it. I don't want it so big that I look like ridiculous, but I'm really liking the aesthetics. I like how it looks, and it just draws your attention when you walk into the room. It really does. Well, guys, I, this is my review on my clock, and I really... I'm giving it five stars across the board. I, I can't say a negative thing about it. I was very, again, impressed with how they packaged it. I will say this, there is cellophane, watch this, okay, over the clock. It's not cellophane, but it's like this bubble wrap substance. As you pull it off, it leaves the screen with all these splotchity things, meaning it's, it's almost like your clock's broke. Like because of uh, the way the clock is made, what's behind the clock, the static electricity is affecting the different things within the screen. Within about two to three minutes, it all goes away. So you might get the clock, you pull off this stuff, okay, that's on top of it. It's like a bubble wrap, but there's static electricity on it. And it leaves like all these little black marks everywhere. Almost like, you know, like you pushed your finger down real hard into it. It goes away. That's normal. That's the static electricity. That's how it is. I even noticed someone had posted some pictures of that. But the only problem is, is it goes away after two to three minutes. So it's really not fair to try to ding these people because that is normal. With this type of advanced clock, okay, that is going to take place. That's why that screen is so crisp and it looks so wonderful. So I hope this helped you out. I hope this gives you some insights. And don't even think about coming over and trying to take my clock. Order your own. I'm just kidding, guys. Thanks for listening.